play on. Alrighty, so uh, it's like our second day living in the new house. Kind of digging it. Still just kind of getting used to the layout and not being in a two-story house. One of the things is like, like we used to live in Corona, which is really, really a long ways from Los Angeles. It's like 60 miles. It's like a suburb. It's in Riverside, Inland Empire. You can Google all that stuff. But rent out there is really cheap. It's like a dollar a square foot. So, you know, like a, a 1,500 square foot house is 1,500 bucks. A 2,000 square foot house is $2,000. When you come to where we are now, it goes up to about two and a half dollars a square foot. So, you know, for that same 2,000 feet, you'd be paying $4,000 per square, like now for the same house, except smaller. Um, so rent kind of skyrockets when you get closer to Los Angeles and the closer you get, the more expensive it gets. And in Beverly Hills and downtown Los Angeles, it can be like nine, 10, 11, 12, 13 14 dollars a square foot and that's when you start to see those celebrity mansions that are just over the top crazy i, I was on craigslist you can find houses in the hollywood hills for rent for like twenty thousand dollars a month um now i don't know who can blow 250 grand a year on rent so moving has just kind of been an entire hassle but we're moved in feeling good I'm gonna be unpacking the garage today. I've got the Bronco in there. I'm gonna just tear everything apart, organize the garage man style, really just gonna man it up. And I'm really looking forward to that. And then hopefully uh, tomorrow I can take the Bronco into Hollywood after I get back from Corona. We got one more load of stuff that we gotta pick up. So I'm gonna head into Hollywood and hang out with my buddy Andre. Should be pretty fun. I'm really excited. This is my first time ever going to hang out with my friends in Hollywood, living in Hollywood. It's like, woohoo! I think I'm in school, grade school again. Oh, righty. So, uh, I just got to my buddy Andre's house, and I thought I'd vlog a little bit before I got in, because uh, I wanted to talk to you guys about Nikki and I's New Year's resolution. Because um, our New Year's resolution, hey, I have the same fence. It's like the fence from our house. Our New Year's resolution for YouTube um, is going to be to do more pranks, but for our vlog channel, it's gonna to be to vlog at least every other day. Um, so we'll have a lot of videos, if not every day. We really wanna start vlogging more um, and just filming everyday stuff for you guys because you guys like it so much. Um, you know, so we wanna give you guys more content, more stuff to watch. And we do really appreciate you guys watching. And I'm wondering what your New Year's resolution is in the comment section below. Uh, go ahead, comment. <laughs> Where's your ball? Corona loves the ball as much as Thor. Where's the ball? Where's your ball? Ugh. Hanging out at Andre's house. He kind of lives really close to Hollywood. One of the really cool things about his house is way off in the distance there. You can see it more when it's not cloudy, but where is it? There it is, the old Hollywood sign. Woot woot. Can you actually zoom in on it? Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. yeah. Nice. Let's see it. Look at that. Bam! Yeah, it's a bit overcast right now. This camera's got a pretty sick zoom. It's a vicious, vicious killer corona. She's old, but she still loves to play, doesn't she? It's funny, dog. It's really crazy living in Hollywood because now I don't have to drive home for like an hour and 15 minutes to Corona. Like normally I would leave here with the anticipation of not being home for another hour and a half, but it's like I'm like 10 minutes away, so it's really weird. Like knowing that I don't have to drive home, I'm just really happy about it. But I'm gonna head back soon and I'm gonna start working on the garage, kind of organize all that stuff, see what Nikki's up to. Red light vlog. So I thought it was kind of funny. Nikki was like, you want an hour later? And earlier I was like, mm, maybe later. And it's totally later now and I'm eating the now and later, so I just thought I'd vlog that, but she thought it was really funny when I was like, mm, maybe later. So I have to say that, uh, this is the last now and later and I'm pretty disappointed that they're gonna be gone. Hey look, there's a guy with a mohawk, I know him. I met him at a party last week, crazy. That was unbelievably crazy. I cannot believe how long it took me to get home. It was seriously like six minutes. You're talking to a guy here that used to have to drive one way an hour and 15 minutes from Hollywood to home. Six minutes! And there was a little bit of light traffic. Like I was like, man, I hope I'm home by four. It's like 3.55, that's crazy. Yes! I'm so happy. Hello, hello, dogs. Did you miss me? Are you enjoying your new home? Good. Me too. Yeah. Hello. Hi. All right. So, I've already been started doing a little work here. Uh, but the majority of my day will consist of unpacking the Bronco, kind of putting everything in the garage, getting it situated. 
really mend it up. So I've, I'm just kind of started organizing stuff here. And I got a lot of stuff to put away, but it should be pretty cool. Nice little garage, good space for me to just be a man, drink some beer. I have this grill that the neighbors gave me for Christmas, which is just unbelievably awesome. It's like the coolest grill ever, and probably one of the greatest Christmas presents I've ever gotten from somebody who wasn't like in my family, and among one of the greatest Christmas presents I have gotten from people even from my family. So I was just so excited to get that, and I'm really, really, really excited to set it up and uh, grill something later on tonight after Nikki and I walk to the grocery store. So it should be. Should be a pretty good time, shouldn't it, Kenobi? Hey, big dog. You think about that yard? Are you happy? And your nose is better? Yeah. Life is good. Oh, man. I always forget, like, how early the sun goes down and then it's just down. It's like, oh, the sun's going down. But I've made an effort kind of organizing everything here, getting all put away. Got some couple things unloaded here, but that's my main priority. Let's get this bad boy unloaded, and then pretty much everything will be done except having to put away my clothes which should be a breeze because I don't have that many. All right, that is all I'm gonna do today. It's about 60% done. I can actually get the Bronco in and this is completely empty. I covered all the seats so that they wouldn't get stuff on them. I thought it was a pretty good idea. And there's a couple more miscellaneous items in here that I probably need to get out, but put this bad boy back in the garage. <laughs> Oh. I love that sound. Well, we have like no food in the house, so we need to buy groceries and we were just kind of driving around until we saw a grocery store and we were like, oh look, it's a Vons. Nope, it's a John's. It's funny because they spell it like the exact same way. I don't know, it's like a knockoff Vons or something. Do we have laundry detergent somewhere? House. Should we? We do? We don't need to buy it? I don't know how much is left. It's a hard decision. Which cottage cheese to get, huh? <laughs> I need to get some CLR too. I've never used it before, but the commercials make it look like it works. The, uh, the house was kind of old and decrepit, you know? So all the bathtubs and stuff is rusty. I need to get rid of some of this rust because the rust is grossing me out. So hopefully it works if I dump some CLR on it, I can just wipe it off. Okay, I found the cleaning aisle. Can you even buy CLR at grocery stores? Or do I need to go to a Target or something that has more cleaning supplies? I'm not seeing it. I guess I should probably get some good old bleach to disinfect. Oh yes, they do have it. All yeah. set? Great. You've been busy. Yay, our first grocery trip living in Hollywood. How do you feel? I like that story. Yeah? Except they didn't have muscle milk. How am I supposed to get strong and be able to beat people up if I don't have any muscle milk to drink. So I changed into some funny clothes so I could clean a little more, and oh my gosh, this CLR stuff is a miracle product. I didn't think it would work that well, and it's just melting rust off. Like, we got the refrigerator used from the old tenants, and it's kind of rusty in there, not that nice, because we were like, well, we just want to get a refrigerator real cheap and fast because the neighbors, Val and Kevin, they're giving us their refrigerator in June because they're getting an, a new one, and their refrigerator is really nice. But this just took some of the rust right off of there. Now I'm gonna go after this little shower in here. There's lots of rust on that. Ooh, it's about pizza time! Oh, it's getting golden. Just about perfect. I'm gonna take it out in a few minutes. We're having pizza tonight because we've just been busy, 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 and we don't really want to make anything, and stuff's still kind of in a mess and shambles, like all this stuff. All these boxes I have our clothes in them, so that's the next step is to do that and to get this put away. What you doing? I am trying to get the rust off of here. This is what they do in the commercials. They put it in a cup and soak the shower head in there. And now that it's completely like rust free. <laughs> yeah. Wow. You're fluffy. I look like I don't have pants on. She doesn't. I actually, I have like really short shorts under here. I do have pants. Who likes short shorts? Thor likes short shorts. Nom nom nom. Perfecto. Hells yeah. Is that delivery? Is it DiGiorno? Yep. <laughs> Wait, you were supposed to say, is it delivery? And I was supposed to say, no, it's DiGiorno. But you said, is it delivery? I yeah. didn't know what brand it was. 
Oh my god, this pizza break is totally hitting the spot right now. Pizza, pizza, pizza. Oh, la, 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 what a day. So it's coming together slowly but surely. All the cabinets filled, the living room's kind of together. Got a couple of the rooms down here together, but yeah. Nikki's been cleaning like crazy. Here is the office. There's Gizmo. But yeah, so it was a pretty good day. Um, don't really have anything else to just say. We're gonna, I got the garage cleaned out. That was awesome. We're gonna keep on working. We have to go to Corona tomorrow to pick up all our stuff and just kind of finish organizing. Just kind of work on putting away the stuff in the last boxes and we'll be in our new house. It's kind of exciting. Thanks for watching guys. Remember to subscribe to the channel. Give us a thumbs up. Please favorite this video and we'll see you next time.